Uh, plus, Swain can really uh, lay a beating on the Nautilus. So we'll see. We'll see now. Ooh. This should be exciting, though. Let's Party. go. Party. Oh. Nice ball move. Impact. <laughs> Impact. Has to blow flash. Oh, he actually didn't flash that far. Uh, he's still slowed by the exhaust. That's why he exhausts early here in the level one fights. Levination, no hesitation there, and they get the kill. They're even going for a blue invade here with the bottom lane pushed up. High's coming over, but there's no smite from FlyQuest, so... What? He flashes back out, and now he's offensive. Whoa. Got a flash. <laughs> Use a flash, blow a flash. Also got the exhaust out of Levination. It worked out a little bit. A little bit of peekaboo going on. Yeah. FlyQuest actually see Jensen. They didn't they didn't see contract sneak in. Oh! Get the flash out of Jensen. That is gonna be a big cooldown. Uh, high uses offensively though. And you can't forget about offensively blown flashes. Even though you're a team that made the move. Oh, bottom, here it is! What we've been waiting for! Nautilus is in. Depth charge isn't far enough now. Impact still has a way to go. True shot barrage, one last attack. It's gonna be going over to Smoothie to start things off for them. They follow up, there's the kill for Sneaky, and Contracts just stays alive as Impact takes aggro. Already got cleared up by the turret. Minion clear once again from high, and they cannot get enough to stop these turrets from going down. Number two here in favor of C9. Straight Ooh. forward goes Impact. Very nice ultimate coming out of him to pop up three, and there may be an engage. Ball sits on the front line trying to heal, but also deal. And nobody goes down on that. Again, their first goal is uh, the standing goal that's pretty open. They actually just now get it, but I'll take takes a good chunk. Oh, open up on the curtain. He actually can't get out of this one. Nicely placed. Ooh, collateral damage. They didn't communicate that one. Could have taken out Sneaky a little faster, but who cares? They get him anyways. 30 seconds on the death timers here. We'll see how long balls can stay alive. Never moves all, but gets Oh, the contact on me. He can slalom the minions, start getting healed from that as well. And he should stay alive. Look, he's not even 50% mono right now. Uh, Impact may not have the damage to make this happen before he gets back. It's going to take a while, but Vols doesn't have anywhere to go. So. Oh, he's still by the brush. <laughs> nice dodge on the never move. Just getting out. But Vols doing his damnedest to go down valiantly and doing as much damage as possible. And the longer you buy time on the other exactly. side of the map, the more time you buy for high to push mid lane, for top lane to shove into turret. There's that Fly quest, goal. strike back. There's the ultimate. Da -da 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 -da. Oh! Pops the potion. The auto attack was actually balked by Jensen. He had to stop as he lost vision. Yeah. High saving his own life there. Flashing into the brush right Woo. there. Flash for flash. If you have the extra information to work around and you get someone there quicker or you cut off a rotation, that can mean the big difference. And there it is, vision advantage. Jensen on award. Hatching that one. <laughs> uh, it's actually one of the few wards that FlyQuest had up. Balls showing here could push them off. Yeah, <laughs> Balls actually might try and kill. <laughs> he walks all the way up to him and just. Wait, Balls didn't even. All right, well, let's look at this turn, actually. So there's the <laughs> ultimate from Contracts. Obviously, Balls is going to have that vision since he was closest. And. The work they're going to try to yeah. do on this one, it looks like it's just a pressure on the turret. Consistently setting up that security vision. Oh, Lemon! Right out of Jensen again. Holy. He just came back. But yeah, Lemon Nation gets squeezed out on that one. 30 seconds was, for him. Uh, aggressive. <laughs> they thought that they had only a couple members they were trying to pick off there, but... Oh, Sneaky gets Shockwave in! Close. Jensen just missing. It's one and one. There's nothing they can fully commit on, but they are making Cloud9 think twice before they just go ahead and engage again. Oh, pings. Pings for pressure, mostly. Control War just actually not seeing anything. Looks like they'll be all right. Not even the pressure. United might actually counter now. Contract's very, very low. He actually has the dot on him as well. He's got to be careful, careful for war damage coming in. Impact, and Jensen flashes forward, oh. goes for it. All tech finds his target. Contracts gets out with a sliver of health, baiting in more attacks. Sneaky, ults on the never move, gets zeroed out on that. Smoothie very low as well as Impact, and Fly was really able to just group up 
continue the damage. And like we said, these are going to be longer fights. Balls is going to live for a while and be on that front line for the team. C9 loses three. So it's basically 4v5 as you can maybe throw a bola. Regardless, now it's a Baron initiation. Ooh, and it does not look good for Fly right now. Contracts picks up balls, takes him down. Oh my! And now actually the kill coming in. Nice flash by Moon. They keep him alive. Baron, High trying to get it. Moon's in the right. He fires the ult backwards for what would have been a true grid over the wall. Gets the smite. They get out with Baron. And that was close. Ah. I understood that chance. It was moon, moon. <laughs> for the smite. <laughs> Look at the wards. And the pinks are coming down for a teleport, but I don't even know if you want to teleport flank on a swing. Oh, he's yeah. gonna. He's gonna. gonna. Try. Jin bullets are missing. So. Ball on the right, flying in. Sneaky's gonna be able to arcane shift away and stop that in his tracks. Red buff and the home guard shut down. It's gonna be the big minion wave. They move over to try and capitalize on. Cloud9 activating immediately with Scatter the Weak. Oh, They're on to Impact. And they still have the turret to fight behind. It has about negative one HP, but it's still standing somehow. Yeah, geez, they got sneaky super low. Balls went down, though, so no more frontline. Oh, line it caught him around. Still has the Edge of Night to use so he can get out of another crowd control. Almost getting the dissonance in. The ball move might even kill Jensen itself there. If Fly can actually get a there fight. There he goes. Oh, if C9 can get a fight here, they'll be stopping Fly very nicely. The turret's all behind Cloud9, about 600 or less HP. So this would be a huge fight now resulting in Cloud9's favor. Balls is going to be next. That True Shot Barrage hitting nicely through two members of the team. And a double kill coming in for Jensen. That's high and Lemon Nation down with Balls as well. Uh, in fact, should be able to... Oh, oh wow. Stand there. still. Yeah. Don't move. Uh, a little bit closer than it needs to be. Not only do you have to actually manage your ultimate cooldown pretty well, um, but you usually want to have it running when you zone yours on the front line so you still have threat. Jensen has to dodge here, though. Oh! oh! He went to flash the end of the line, a collateral and the shot from Curtain Call. Yeah. Not much you can do about a wombo like that. Great job by Altec holding on to that bullet until Moon is able to move up and remove yeah. any space that Jensen had to dodge. Let's see All what right. they can do with that pick, though. You know it's going to be one person's down. High says that's 100% Baron. We're going to hit this 50-50. Be damned. And they may pull off for the fight. Watch it's going to be Balls wave. taking a lot of damage. He needs to get the heal up here. He could easily be a focus. Impact gets absolutely shredded as the tankiest one on the team. And that means C9 has to look scared here. Oh, Sneaky in. Sneaky with the flash what? in. No, we know the results of the flash in. Sneaky does his damnness to stay alive now. There's the shields. Great job by Smoothie and the rest of the team to keep him alive. Shockwave now onto Contracts as he goes down. There's your arcade step forward. Nine. <laughs> Get the fight lost there. Three down for them. Jensen just came back up. Fly is low and Baron has fully. Oh, feet. it's still touch and go. Jensen won't have time. We've seen the Glitter Lance steal and a Mystic Shot can do the same. Too many members oh. in front. That's the Baron for high and the team. Fly Quest make it out alive with all five. Just in time, dude. Jensen's on the way. He has Ghost up. He's looking for a straggler kill oh, here, actually. Ooh. Not going to get it, though. They don't have any deeper vision. So, man, Fly Quest are able to get out with that Baron. You know, Balls does have teleport, and yep. you can send him to get the other one pushing there and try and disengage to allow time for his teleport candle to go off, but they're just sticking with five members Ooh. mid. They throw down Beatrice onto Impact, slows him down. That's the ultimate Double coming kill. in from Lemon. Contracts looking for an over-the-wall jump. Whoa! Onto Balls. He actually didn't find the target he wanted. Nice true shot barrage. Sneaky goes forward, picks up the first kill of the fight. Lemon Nation. Gets back, he is very low, and Cloud9 eat a shockwave coming in from high that settles the fight a little bit. Jensen gets the hit, the shield on him, keeps him alive, and he didn't go down to the end of the line as it comes back with damage. Slivers of health as C9 is limping away from the fight. They will lose mid. Jensen and I is just on the back line and almost walked into a certain death there. Takes a chunk of damage, now FlyQuest, even though they don't get a kill, they move up and they get an inhibitor turn in the end. Undead Moon somehow in this uh -oh. game. 11 to 13, 5, 0, and 6. Lemon Nation and the team set up to take Impact down. Can they shred him? The continuous lockdown as they layer the crowd control. The curtain call will be for him. I don't know how he can dodge his Nautilus. The last shot uh -oh. will take him down. Sometimes I think that thing just weighs him down. 
39 minutes on the clock. They're going to be going for Elder Drake on the side of FlyQuest. All right, Contracts might go for a steal here. Or actually, C9 move in to contest. Balls, very nice job on the front oh. line, but he gets shredded. The Sonyas for the ultimate of Jensen. Pulls it out, baits it in, and they take him down. Impact and Jensen now waiting to get back up as FlyQuest start to take everything on the map. And the minion wave in the bot side slowly pushing in as, as well as top. The dragon still ticking for a little bit longer. Pull in, three oh. man depth charge. And it looks like the damage is going to be over. Now on to Alltech. Down high was already dropped in the beginning of the fight as Lemon Nation is a focus. Jensen soloing balls on the bottom side towards mid lane. And he may be able to drop the last Q. He will not. The hammer doesn't follow. Balls and Moon get out alive. But oh. Cloud9 has been waiting for this fight and are able to stop what was a Baron up, then Elder Dragon FlyQuest on a push. Yeah, they not only stop it, they're going to push it right back down FlyQuest's throats here with these two minions. Looks like they're going to be able to put some hurt onto this turret. They did impact go to, to go deal with the minion waves, but Contracts is going to face tank so that the minions don't die and the uh, extra resistances aren't applied to the turret. Oh, these, th those are the ones that hurt. You're in the lead the whole time, but the game is so late. Anything that happens now gives the team so much more. Teleport used as well. This sucker is dead. Look at that burn. <laughs> no chance, Baron. No chance. Whoa, flash in. Lemonation's the hit. If they can clear out Lemonation, that means a lot of the crowd control here is gone. Besides that ultimate from high, he's forced to flash. Throws back the dissonance to hopefully slow. The aggression of Cloud9, but they have bought time. They held their breath. They got the fight they wanted in the mid lane inhibitor. And I think they may have just closed it out on FlyQuest. Oh, yes, they have. Baron there for C9. Plus, they jump on FlyQuest as soon as they come through the jungle. And that is going to be an end to the series. What an exciting game number two, though. Pretty back and forth. Very back and forth. We are going to see one hell of a series here coming in for the rematch, but it will be. Cloud9 taking the 2-0 in the end over FlyQuest.